everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Castlevania 2 Simon's Quest with me, Rock Paper Mario, and in the last part, we did the second last mansion, and in this part, we're gonna do the last mansion! So yeah, it's not gonna be a long, long time before we finish this game. This is probably the second last part, which is crazy! I can't believe the next part is the last part, so that'll make the- this is the third video I'm recording today, so that means this is part 9. So that makes this like an even 10 parts, which is pretty cool. Oh, stupid bone man. Get out of my way, please. Thank you. No, you just had to come by and hit me in the back when my... Ugh, when my back was turned. Okay, I have a feeling there's like... Invisible blocks. You can never be too careful with where they put those invisible blocks in this stupid game. Okay, where are we? So yeah, you... If, if you're feeling a bit kind of nervous... Like, I remember where they are in, like, the first couple of mansions, but I kind of start to forget then, so... <laughs> forgive me. PLEASE! RELEASE ME! Hey, Skeleton Man. Skeleton Man's just scared, because Belmont's bringing the funk to the game. And if you know Belmont... Is Belmont his first or second name? <laughs> I'd say it's his f second name. <laughs> Aww. Well, no, his name wasn't Belmont, it was Beaumont. Beaumont Livingston! But it was actually Beaumont was his first name, I don't know. Um, so yeah, is this- Yeah, you have to go up here, and I went down. She chose down! She chose down! She chose down! Those hands. We're helping hands. <laughs> She chose to I just really love that part in the movie. It's so funny. Why did she choose down? That was so stupid. Because if she had chosen up, then all that would have happened was she could have gone like... They would have brought her back up. And she could have gone through the other door. That's what I always think in that part. Because like... No, wait, couldn't I just jump over this guy? And then jump and whip him. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. Yeah, you have to go up here. I chose down the last time, so I'm gonna choose up this time. She chose down! She chose down! Golden dagger. Golden dagger, silver hammer came down upon her head! There we go. No! I missed! Is that stupid skeleton man gonna be up there again? Yeah, he is. I believe I missed it. That's one of those jumps that you have to be like halfway off the platform. There we go. Yeah, and here's this is where the next um the oak steak man is. So he's directly on your way. Invest in an oak steak! Of course, my good man. Take my pen knife, my good man. <laughs> man, I'm actually gonna miss this game. I've been having a really fun time LPing this game, but as I said, I just wanted to kind of get it over and done with because it was taking like a long time. And I kind of, it was, and I think it's gonna be a long, long time. Yeah, it, it was like kind of taking a long time. Oh no, you just, no, go away. Those stupid skeletons that throw bones are really irritating. There's actually a boss in this place as well. There are only three bosses in this game, and this is one of the places that has them, so. No, why did I do that? No, throw a golden dagger. Do I have enough hearts? Yeah, I have plenty of hearts. You want to kind of have a good enough amount of hearts to be able to use the golden dagger, so... Okay, there's like a part where you have to jump, isn't there? Yeah! No, 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 no. Yeah, you have to jump on that part, because you see there, up at the top where I jumped, if you were to just drop off the edge, you'd be inside that wall on the left, and you'd have to like, um... You'd have to go, um... back around. It's kind of like a trap, so yeah. No, what the hell was that?! What the fuck?! And now we got the spiders. The spiders from Mars. So yeah, you're gonna want- Oh, here we go, golden dagger. And you can get this guy, like, trapped if you use the golden dagger at the right time. So yeah, but he's not that scary if you have, like, Dracula's rib. There we go. Yeah, you can, like, get him trapped in, like, a bad cycle, but he's not that dangerous. Seriously, golden dagger is the- There we go. You now possess the magic cross because the power of Christ compels you. And here's the last body part. We've got Dracula's body parts. Oh my god, so let's get our oak steak. And for the last time, 
You now possess Dracula's ring. And that's the last one. That is the last body part. We have his rib, his heart, his eye, his owl's beak, his ring, his red crystal. I don't know. <laughs> so now what we have to do is make it our way out here. But there's actually something I'd like to do here first. Wait a second. Let's get past him first because he's going to start trying to kill us. Yeah, that, that guy's pretty cool. He always reminds me of you know, the masks in Mario Brothers 2. Let's try and get rid of the away from these guys. There's like a secret. No, 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 no. No, I died! Seriously? I did not just die. Continue. Come on. Is there a way I can go up there like that way that's safe? Like, if I had, like, an extra laurel, I'd like to use it in this part. Because, like, if you come over to this guy, he says, I beg of you to take these laurels! And look, he gives us eight laurels, so we're gonna get them, equip them right away. And use them, so that we can go, like, across these spikes without any trouble. There we go. Now... And now we just have to get out of this mansion, and we're going to be on the road to killing Dracula. So yeah, definitely. Um, if you have, like, an extra laurel, then use it when you're going past. I, I, like, shouldn't have used that third one that time. A watcher going to appear, like, both at the same time. You can't do that. No, 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 no. Why did his, like, spider web disappear? Oh, I whipped it. That's what happened. Um, but yeah, so now what we have to do is make our way out of the mansion and we'll be on the road to killing Dracula, so how bad can that be? Haha, <laughs> how's that for expert dodging, seriously? No, 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 then you just, yeah, expert dodging, no, expert dodging of the spider web and then you just walk into a skeleton like a lunatic, seriously? And now he's gonna start, like, throwing his bones at me! He's gonna start throwing Dr. McCoy at me. Could you imagine someone throwing ha Dr. McCoy at you from Star Trek? <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about now. I'm just being silly. I just want to get out of this place. And then in the next video, we'll head to Dracula. How many hearts do I have now? Seven. Seriously? I'm going to need to build up some hearts for the net for fighting Dracula. I can't believe I got a game over twice. And it was those stupid spikes that did it. Seriously? Um... Yeah, what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to end this video when I get out of the mansion. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to come back into the mansion. I'm going to grind for a few hearts because I don't like having... No. I don't like having just this amount of hearts going against Dracula because... I don't know, it just... I just don't like... I you Because I'm going to be using the Sacred Flame to fight Dracula and that uses up hearts. I shouldn't need that many because I'll be picking up hearts on the way there, but I'd like to have at least 50 before heading for there. Look, I have 29 now, so that shouldn't take that much time, so... Once we get out of this place, I'll end off the video. And I guess the last part is going... The next part is going to be the last part of Let's Play Castlevania 2 Simon's Quest. Oh, I'm not, not going to pass that up. So, yeah. I guess I'll see you next time. Wait, no, has that all that we've been done? Yet? No, let's let's talk for a bit more. If I can get like, if I can get like a couple of more hearts, I'll finish off the video. Cause I'm not going sitting there grinding until it's night time or something. I don't know. Do you know what I'm gonna do? Do you know where I'm gonna meet you? When I meet you, I'll be back at where Deborah Cliff dropped us off in front of the previous mansion. That's where I'm gonna be. So I'm gonna go past all that. No, I'm not. Yeah, do you know what? We're gonna head there now. We're gonna head there in this video, cause like, it's night time and we're gonna need our laurels again. The best thing about having seven laurels is that you don't even have to worry about how much of them you use, cause we're gonna use three of them now to go through here, and we're still gonna have four. We're still gonna have four when we get to the other side, so seriously, it do it's not even a problem. Yeah, I was hoping I could get by with you. You can use two. You can get by there with two if you have enough energy. But I just didn't have enough energy the last time. Ooh, these guys are going to drop good hearts this time. No, no, no. If I could stop dying. 
I'm gonna get out the golden dagger because it's just those firemen are too dangerous to be skimping on it. No, 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 you can't die now. You cannot die now. I'm not allowing you to die now. Man, those stupid fireballs! Fireballs, yum! Okay, here we go. Just get past here as quickly as possible. And the morning sun has vanquished the horrible night. Because the sun will come out tomorrow. Bet your bottom dollar that tomorrow there'll be sun. Just thinking about tomorrow takes away the darkness and the sorrow. Oh my god, I really like that song. That's actually a really no like nicely written song when you think about it. I don't know. But then you know me, I'm a big sentimental softy, aren't I? No, no, no! I died again! I died again! I died again! I can't believe I died again. I've been dying way too much. Like, this game is a lot easier than I'm making it look. It's just that it's a lot harder to play this and come. No, I'm not going to make that excuse. Like, I'd like not to make that excuse, but it is completely true that it's far easier to play a game when you're not commentating as well, so... Basically, where we're going now is, do you remember Deborah Cliff? Um, I speak of Deborah Cliff as if she were a woman, um, but do you remember Deborah Cliff dropped us off? I love the background here, by the way. It reminds me of those levels that I saw in Donkey Kong Country 3 when Hedonia was LPing it. So yeah, Deborah Cliff wa um, dropped us off here, so... And we're just going to try and make... There's another town before we get to Dracula's place, so if I can make it to that town while it's daytime, and get healed up because I'd swear there's a ch well no it doesn't even matter now does it so I guess what I'm gonna do is make it to the next town oh no harpies queen of the harpies queen of the harpies yeah if you just walk past them they they don't even hit you it's ridiculous no I was facing the wrong way you're going the wrong way yeah those harpies if you just walk past them it's hilarious they don't even do anything so yeah this is the last town in the game before Dracula well no it's not but I guess in the next part, it's going to be the last part of Let's Play Castlevania 2 Simon's Quest with me, Rock Paper Mario. And I guess I'll see you next time.